the Lord and good morning. Today we are talking still about glorifying God, but this time we are talking about glorifying God with our skills. What is that particular skill that the Lord has given you that you can be able to glorify the Lord with? You know, sometimes we wake up and I'm like, God has talented me in this area and you just do it and some of us become so proud and so arrogant because you feel like this is me, this is my skill and so you just trample on everybody else without understanding that the skill that you have comes from the Lord. Listen to what the Bible says in Exodus chapter 31 the, from verse 1 says the Lord said to Moses, see I have called my name Bezalel. I have called my name Bezalel, the son of Uri, son of Hor of the tribe of Judah. And I have filled him with the spirit of God with the ability and intelligence and with knowledge and all craftsmanship to Device artistic designs to work in gold, silver, in cutting stones for setting up in carvings, to work in every craft. And behold, I have appointed with him a holy. You can read that that uh, through even up to verse seven. One thing that I want to bring here is that God is telling Moses that look. I have appointed people and I have given them skill. What I want you to understand today is that the skill that you have, maybe you are good in construction, maybe you are good in accounts, maybe you are good in singing, maybe you are good in just cooking, maybe you are a good mother, maybe you are a good housewife, maybe you are a good husband, maybe all those skills that God has given you. I just want you to understand today that God has given you those skills to serve his people. And God designs people. He's saying that I have appointed Bezalel and I know that I have given him this skill and he's going to use this skill to serve me. I want to pray this morning, my brother, my sister, for the skill that God has given you. Can you use that skill to serve the Lord? You know, have you ever seen someone who is skilled in a certain area? You call them to do something, and when they come, instead of doing that particular thing, they just behave funny because they feel like, I am the only one after all. Where will you get another one? And some of us have lost our jobs that way. Why? It's just because God has given you a skill, you don't want to utilize it, Instead, you are bragging about the skill that God has given you. You are into this business. You are thriving. And in when God has given you that thriving business, you begin to trample on others. You begin to jump on others. You know, friends, in Uganda, we've seen investors. God has given them the skill, the wisdom, the money. But you see how they are trampling over the poor. They jump over people's land. They want to construct here. They want to construct here. And they speak like a bosses, even when they know that what I'm taking actually does not belong to me. That is how we have misused the talents, the skill, the finances and everything the Lord has given us. And friends, we are going to be answerable for that which we are doing. The misuse of the skills that God has given us. The misuse of the finances that God has given us. At the end of the day, we are going to stand before the judgment seat and we are going to have to give accountability for every skill that God has given us. And in giving accountability, remember there is heaven. Remember there is hell. You are going to miss the target to go to heaven simply because of the skill the Lord has given you and you have misused it. Every skill, every gift, everything that you have comes from the Lord. Will you utilize it to bring glory and honor to the Lord? And all the blessings that the Lord has will come upon you. And all the increase of the land, the increase of the business, the increase of the finances, the Lord will give it to you. But if you utilize it for your own personal agenda, and also with the arrogancy and all the pride that all is mine and I have it all, my dear sister, my dear brother, you are accountable shall we pray our father and our god we give you thanks for the skills that you have given us and we pray lord jesus that we'll utilize all these skills to bring glory and honor to your name and we'll never regret what we have done we give you praise for in jesus name we pray amen and may god bless you mm -hmm.